Hey guys, welcome back. This is Cause and Cloud. So in this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to add a vanity domain to your Office 365 tenant. So when you first have a tenant, you don't have your own vanity domain. Everything's going to be like .onmicrosoft.com. Um, the default domain .onmicrosoft.com. So you want to add your own domain, for example, ABC d.com or 12345.com so let's get started first I need to log into portal.office.com you must be a global administrator to do this here's my Global admin, admin account, click OK. Enter my password. Sign in. Uh, this is my own machine, so I'm going to say don't show again and remember the uh, credentials. So once you're in here, you need to go to admin, click click on admin here. On the left pane here, you want to click on show all. And you should find settings. Under settings, you should see domains. So here's the default domain. Now I'm going to click on add domain. I'm going to add my domain. I'm going to click next. I'm going to use the second options. If you choose the top part, uh, Office 365 will um, set everything up for you um, all the other difference uh, DNS so I'm going just to do uh, add text record instead click next what you need to do is you want to copy this link here by click on this clipboard now it's copy and you want to go into your domain registrar whatever it is Mine is godaddy.com. Click on sign in. Register users. Here's my domain. I'm going to click that and click on manage. Click on manage DNS under additional settings. Here it is. I'm going to click Add. And it's according to Microsoft here, it says it has to be a text record. And the TTL is 3600. So it's going to be type is text record. This is the host is at the value. Is MS and TTL is 3600 so it's one hour I'm going to choose the default click on save and that's it now you have to go back into your office admins admin center it's gonna take a few maybe a few minutes or a few hours it all depends let's verify see if that works
So it looks like it's finished. Let's take a look. Save close. No, it's not done. I guess it's uh, going to take some time. Continue setup. Click next. You can also add the. Um, oops, so there it is. Congratulations, your domain email address set up. I'm going to click finish. Yep, so now it is healthy. And if I want to add another domain, all I have to do is just add a domain. I have another domain called O365Guy.com. And you just go through the same process. Go to sign in with GoDaddy or verify your email, or you can add a text record instead. So just follow the first process that you, um, you did for your first domain. Thank you for watching. And if you like the video, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and have a wonderful day.